So a few months back, I was listening to Kim Russo's book on Audible, and in it, she states a theory that all psychic mediums had a strong electrical shock by the age of 10. And that got me thinking, had I been electrocuted before the age of 10? Yeah, a few times, actually. Shaman Oaks, exploring the rabbit hole. The first time I ever remember getting shocked was, uh, I want to say around the age of five or six. There was a long hallway outside of my bedroom where we always kept a nightlight. And I remember one night in the middle of the night, I woke up and noticed the nightlight wasn't plugged in. So I got up in the night and went to go plug it in. And instead of plugging it into the socket, I plugged my finger into the socket. And <laughs> it, it hurt, you know, it shocked me. The second one I can think of is we had a neighbor across the street that had an electrical fence to keep their big Doberman pincher out of their yard. And the father, something was wrong with him because he thought it was funny that if we would touch the electrical fence. And so there was numerous times where I would touch the electrical fence and get shocked. And he even told us at one point, oh, grab it. If you grab it, then you won't be able to let go. It's like, who does that? What kind of fathers was I living next to? What kind of neighbors do that? So I got it shocked at least two or three times that way. So the third time that I can remember was there was an arcade down the street that like served pizza and had arcade games. And in the back, they had one arcade game that just had two metal things that stuck out and you could, you just held on to them and you held on to them as long as you could while it shocked you. So I don't know if you guys ever had experience one of those sort of games, but it's, it's crazy. You basically just see how long you can get electrocuted. So I lived in this house from ages three to like age 11. So I know all of these experiences happened within that time frame, And that's also the house where I first started seeing ghosts for the first time. So I'm not exactly sure which came first, the electrical shock or seeing ghosts, but it's, it's interesting, it's an interesting theory. So I'm very, very curious if any of you guys out there that consider yourselves a psychic medium or you know psychic in any way, or that see ghosts, did you, did you, were, you, were you shocked as a kid? Did you, were you, did you get electrocuted? Oh, one time my sister was dating a cop and I asked him to taser me. So I have been tasered. I have had a strong electrical shock as an adult as well. I think I was in my late twenties, early thirties though, when it happened. So it might be too late in life to become a psychic because of it. But yeah, he legit shocked me in the leg and it, it hurt, it hurt. Basically my body just went like, this, just went like up like that. And then I just went limp to the floor. So yeah, so uh, stay curious, keep exploring. But uh, don't go electrocuting yourself. It's not safe.